Hi everybody, welcome back to the channel. Um, I just wanted to make this short video that may help other people um, out with this little problem that took me the best part of two days to figure out. Um, for anybody else that's um, wanting to use, use the um, new generation of flight controllers uh, with the Hobby King open LRS receiver I had a real problem um, in that I couldn't get the S bus output to work from the receiver so as you can see I've got a Matek F405 wing um, flight controller and on there is an S bus input which is there So what I did was I programmed the OpenRSNG receiver to output SBUS on pin 13, which you can see the white wire there is plugged into on the OpenRS receiver, thinking that should do it. And no output at all on SBUS, nothing whatsoever. So it's had me kind of stumped for a couple of days and eventually I contacted Mirtech support and they told me that the RX2 pin next to the S bus there come on focus you was on Uninverted input, or they told me that the S bus pin was the opposite of the R2 pin. So then I discovered that this particular receiver does send out S bus, but it's an uninverted S bus signal. And obviously, I plugged the um, output into the S bus pin, nothing happened. So that's when I discovered switching the white wire on the Matek to the R2 pin, which is an uninverted input. It's all to do with inversion on SBUS. And voila, the damn thing came straight up. Working. And gave me 16 channels. Of SBUS, which I can show you now. It's actually SUMD to tell you the truth. I'm using SUMD rather than SBUS. That's the 16 channels working there. I have all 16 channels on one pot just as a test. And under the configuration tab, you can see there I have. serial based receiver selected there and underneath Sunday and that works absolutely fine 16 channels Sunday from an open LRS hobby king open LRS receiver which gives out which gives out an uninverted S bus signal into the R2 pin not the S bus pin if that output from that receiver had been an inverted output it would have worked fine on the S bus, the S bus input anyway that had me scratching my head for a couple of days maybe this video will help somebody else out that's trying to get a hobby king open LRS receiver working with a Matek flight controller I'm not sure if the other brand of open LRS receivers provide an inverted or uninverted output but the Hobby King one definitely provides an uninverted S bus signal and it won't work on the S bus pin unless you build an inverter of course 
so this might help somebody hopefully thanks for watching catch you later bye now